Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing well. Um, it's currently five to five. I'm on my way to the farm, five to five a.m. Uh, so I'm just on my way to the farm to start milking. I'm milking with Dave this morning. So yeah, I'm going to take you along and I hope you enjoy this video and we'll see you when we get to the farm. This side's getting ready to go. Just waiting for the last few to finish. in that clip but we've got a flushing um a flushing system so it flushes once which will get rid of most of the milk and then it'll flush again in about i think it's 30 seconds and it's water with parax acid in it so just killing all the bugs killing everything that might be in the units ready for the next ones to go on so we've got the next side going in come on girls Go check, um, see if anything's calm. Oh, what's going on here? She's asleep, you know. Girls. We've not got so many down here at the minute. Yeah. Oh. Who's that pushing at the back? One sec. Just gonna sneak up and see if I can see her. Guys. So it's just this girl here. There's no um, no water bleb or anything there. She's not showing anything, but she is bagged up and she's pushing. <laughs> so we will see. I'll keep checking on her throughout the morning. I'm gonna get nip to the um I'm gonna nip to the computer and see when she's due. Uh, what number is she? One ten. Yeah, one ten. So I'm gonna go and see when she's due and uh, I'll keep an eye on her throughout the morning because she looks a little bit uncomfortable. So we might have a baby on the way. <laughs> Are you lot waiting for me? You want some milk? You little cuties? I won't be long and I'll bring you some milk, okay? Right, here we go, we use um, uniform. So if I type, is it 110? In there, she's dry cow, she's inseminated. Dry off joke, there we go. Carving date, 2nd of the 6th. Oh, okay. So yeah, she could well be on with carving because we're on the 8th of the 6th. So she's a little bit late. So yeah, that might be her starting with it. 
nice. Such a nice day today. Yeah, we're going We've got two sprays, we've got the pre spray, which is the blue one, and the toast spray, which is the I can't speak at all. Toast spray, which is the yellow. So these cows will just all come in and they'll all get sprayed with the pre spray. So we pre spray everything, kill all the bugs, and um, you know, disinfect the teeth to get them nice and wet to keep them conditioned. So then once we pre sprayed, we then go in with a dry wipe. I'll show one that's actually easy to show. So that's what we do then, dry wipe everything, nice and clean. Uh, we don't strip anything out, as in drawing anything out, unless there's a suspected mastitis, it's got a harder pore to if I feel it when we're wiping it and that sort of thing. But apart from that, I will not strip anything out, I'll just put the unit straight on. Then when the units come off, she's obviously been milked, no milk left in there, and then she's gonna go in and get a uh, post break. And that's that. Milking routine. Right, I've got two sides on now, so they'll be a good five minutes or so yet. So I'm just gonna go and check that um, one that looks like it's on with carving. Cars are waiting patiently for me. Oh, that's what she's got up. She's up, she's just having a wee, but I definitely think she will be on with carving at some point. It might not be this morning. I hope it is though. Have you come to give us some pointers? Because you're a mummy too. Is that what you're doing? Come to help her out. Good game. Yeah, she's definitely on with carving. She's uncomfortable, bless her, she doesn't really know what to do. Hi girls, these have been milked, these are on with going down the race. They'll go down there and get foot bathed. Um, everything gets foot bathed twice a day, so every time they get milk, they go down and get foot bathed. Come on girls. Come on. This is risky business. <laughs> Come on, good girl. Oh, this cow always head butts her off a step as well. <laughs> Come on, let her pass. Sit, come on. Hey, girly. Come on, maybe this we can go out. I'm going to go back in here now. You go out there. So I like to keep it all nice and clean here throughout the morning. So once we've got a full side on, I'll go down with the volume washer and just clear it all off. Keep the units nice and clean. Wash off any legs. Wash away any more. Right, I'll just give you a quick rundown because this is like my most common asked question on my channel. We milk, we actually real, milk, milk recorded yesterday morning. Yeah, yesterday morning. And we are milking 297 cows, mainly Holstein Friesian, as you can see. Um, we're on twice a day milking. We farm around 300 acres. Um, um, we're on a high input, high output um, system. So ask, oh, we don't rear our own young stock, we're a flying herd. This is Bertha. She's a great one. She's saying hello. Oh yeah. No, she doesn't want to say hello. Um, so yeah, we don't rear anything, so we are classed as a flying herd. Um, we bull everything, everything we have, we bull to a beef bull. So we either bull it to a blue or an Aberdeen Angus, which is to do with our milk contract. They want 25% of our calves to be an Angus and then they buy them, we sell to Sainsbury's. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to tell you. It's hard to think first thing in the morning. Um, anything Bertha? No, that's all I can think of so far. It's a favourite place to sit that. She'll sit there every morning just like watch the sunrise. She's so cute. Right, I'm going to start feeding some carbs. Why is the tank beeping? Okay, go. Wow, 
Where's Russell at? Where's Russell? Is he not here? Okay. Russell would normally be the one to come and get the milk, wouldn't he? He does. Russell actually likes to do like a 10k run every morning, doesn't he? You just don't go with him. He just um, <laughs> goes for a run down the road every morning around, oh yeah, it's, I thought it was later than that. It's about half six. So yeah, Russell will be on his run. He likes to keep fit, you know? So he'll be back shortly, no doubt. <laughs> oh, I spilled a bit. Can you clean it up? Yummy! Take this to the food pen. Beep beep. In the morning they get a fresh bucket of milk and then wipe all the pipes down with a bit of blue roll. Right, pipes are clean. Come on guys. Oh, that'd avert that. Please don't do that to me. Ow, you little buggers. Come on. Eager beavers. Come on. There you go. That's it. First pen are all on. Four farmers have just got here, so they're bringing the prob in that goes above the parlour in the loft for the parlour cake. Oh, that means it's going to be really noisy in the parlour now. I'll, uh, I'll bob up and show you actually because I don't think I've shown you up in the office. So it's really loud in here because the milk pump's here, so you might not be able to hear me that well. Up, which come in three different pipes to evenly spread it out. So we've got one, two, and three at the back. So yeah, let's we'll see if he's backed in. Watch me deck it now. I always have to slide down here. Whoop, whoop. So this is what we call beach height, so eight and a half, fifteen and a half. It says it on the board in here. Yeah. Where's he gone? Oh, Russell's back from his run. <laughs> Bloody hell man, you don't look so bright. It says in there. Yeah, it says on the board, eight and a half up number one.
I'll try and do so many things at once. Milk overflowing now. Oh dear. So I'm going to fill this one up first and I'll bring this one full and then we'll I'll come back in near the end of milking and see if I've got to fill that one as well. I think I will have to because we're at 8 2 now and it's 5 past 7. Just my little maths in the head from day to day what goes on. I think I will have to fill the little tank as well. Um, but yeah, this won't take me too long. Fill this up and then I'll come back in in another 40 minutes or so and see where the big tank's at again. Right, there we go. Near enough brim. And I mean brim. So one more second and then we'll shut that off. Oh, this is so needed this morning. I'm so thirsty. I think I've got a um, sweat dash, so cheers to that. <laughs> Take the bruise out to these two outside. Oh, Richard's just gone up there, so he's not going to see me. So dusty in here this morning. Ben! He's seen me. This is really hard trying to balance. Watch me drop it now. big cows but she's not massive i think you know what there's not even an excuse they've just been awkward they don't like to push up in the parlor and snow is the main culprit aren't you and she likes coming in the back and i swear she knows how to count because nine times out of ten she gets it bang on sometimes she does come in with a gap in front of her but i feel like you just do that when you want a bit extra space don't you love that bit extra leg room so yeah not snow Right, I've just heard the gate, so they've all been shut in. Have a look, see how many's left. 
I'd say about four sides, Ooh. which means I need to go and check the tank. Right, I'll go and check the tank again, which <laughs> I am. Um, although I'm always giggling to myself, um, we've had two. Whoa, we've had two milk overflow villages this morning. So sorry about that, Dad. <laughs> um, it's hard work vlogging and doing it all. Right, the tank is at. Right, the tank's eight three, four sides left. I reckon we'll be all right in just these two this morning. I'll bob back again, but that should be fine. That's it, that one and then snow. The last one. Right, we're finishing the parlour now. Everything's been milked, I've washed out, jetters are on. Dave's gonna swill out in here and I'm gonna go and wash out in the dairy. This one's just been beeping full tank, it's at 895 and by the time I've flushed through the whole system, which is what I'm doing now, sucking up the water, uh, flushing all the units out in the parlour and that sort of thing, and then by the time that's gone into the tank, that'll be full full, and then we've also put a bit in this one as well, so yeah, I didn't think we'd need that one this morning, but we did, so yeah, all the tanks are full, can you clean it up again, very helpful. Right, we're finished now. We're just going to go in for breakfast. Uh, so I'm going to leave the video there. That cow still hasn't carved yet, but if she does carve, um, I'll try and slot it in before I edit it and put the video on tonight. Uh, so yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. And if you haven't done already, please like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. What is going on here? That's a snazzy stick. Take it outside. Take it outside. Come on, take it out.